Dexter, a fawn-coloured French bulldog, lives with his human in an apartment in New York City. He eats food cooked especially for him, has four beds and countless tennis balls. Size small, of course. According to his human, Dexter enjoys eating, sleeping and sniffing. But Dexter has another life his human knows nothing about. He is the famous Detective Dexter. Every morning after his human leaves for work, Dexter puts on his detective hat, heads out onto the terrace, leaps onto the ledge and hops onto the fire escape where he keeps an office. His trusty assistant, a Pomeranian named Peanut, is always early and there is always a line of city dogs who need help. Dexter is with Baxter, the barking tree frog. He's had a whole tour of the city and met Baxter's sister, Belinda. She's got a case. Dexter listens to the details as they munch on delightful Cuban food in Little Havana. Well, he munches. The frogs snatch any passing insect they can. We got trouble brewing here. Sheila the iguana told me that Camilla the boxer said that Alvaro the terrier saw Elena the poodle and Julio the German shepherd canoodling at the races Friday night. Okay. Nothing wrong with two dogs hanging out. Pals, friends, besties. No. But if it's Elena and Julio, it's a big problem. You see, detective, just like there are neighborhoods in New York, we got neighborhoods here too. And we got families who live in those neighborhoods. It is the same in New York. I'm sure it is. And when two families are at odds, I'm sure you'd never expect to see any of them socializing. No, that would cause serious trouble. Exactly. And this is the case? Elena and Julio, the poodle and the shepherd, they are forbidden to see one another? Yep, but they were together. I heard they shared a popcorn. And in public, don't even get me started. I see your concern, but I'm failing to see how I can help. I am not a romance counselor. <laughs> <laughs> They're missing! Poof! Gone! Friday night was the last time anyone seen either of them. So they ran off together? Nope. There was a note. There was a note? Tell me now. Frankie the Frenchie told me. What did it say? Turn over your territories or you'll never see the lovebirds again. Oh, jeez. That's serious. Can we speak to this Frankie? I'll take you there right now. Come on. Well, actually, it's faster if you give us a ride, detective. Hop on. The frogs leap onto Dexter's back. He hops onto his skateboard and they're off. Belinda gives directions and soon enough, they are back in Winwood outside an art gallery. A brindle-pied French bulldog sleeps by the door. Yo, Frankie! The bulldog keeps snoozing. Frankie! He doesn't move. Yo, Frankie, get out here. Frankie looks up. Uh, who's that? Baxter and Belinda. I am Dexter. Frankie gets up and walks over to them. He sees the frogs. Oh, I see you now. <laughs> you guys are small. Who knows who's talking? Who you calling small? Don't lick me. Take it back or I will. But uh, you are small. It's not a matter of opinion. It's a fact. Baxter's tongue flies out of his mouth. It sticks right onto Frankie's cheek. Okay, I, I take it back. Baxter reels in his tongue, then quickly lashes it out again, snagging a fly. You are feistier than Peanut. Feisty is my middle name. Guys, can we stop the small talk and get down to business? We got two missing dogs. Frankie. Belinda tells me you have seen the note that was left where Elena and Julio were last seen. Even better. I can take you there, but uh, not in daylight. Gotta be at night. Undercover, you know? Meet me here tonight. We will be back. Bring treats if you want to bet on the race. We accept carrots, bacon, peanut butter balls, and uh, cheese cut in squares, not rectangles. You bring rectangles, you're out. 
Dexter, Belinda and Baxter head home for a bit. They get together again once the moon has risen and head back to meet Frankie in Winwood at the art gallery. Before we arrive, you told me so many things, but what is this race everyone speaks of? You wanna take this one? Probably best. The Chihuahua races. They're epic, fabled, legendary. The main event. Yeah. Beforehand, you got some smaller stuff. Iguanawanas, Tic-Tac Tarantulas, Grinding Gators. They race, we put down some treats. Winner takes home dinner. You know what I mean? Interesting. When they arrive at the gallery, Frankie is already outside. There's a party going on. Looks like you got some time on your paws. Oh, yeah. The human's having a show. Uh, gonna be a busy night. Sometimes I pee on the artwork before they put it up. Forget the buyer. It's marked as mine. <laughs> that is so rude. I'm a dog. I sniff, I lick, I pee. I can't help where and when. If the canvas gets in my way, not my fault. Finally, they reach the races. It's an old track by the train station in Coconut Grove. There are animals everywhere. Someone's brought old flashlights and laid them out so they've got a great view of the whole track. It's the iguana's turn, and around they go, slowly but steady, each balancing a snail on their head. If the snail falls, they're out. This way. Frankie leads them to a fallen palm leaf. It's huge. He grabs it and flips it over. I put the leaf over it so uh, it didn't get blown away. And so no one saw it. We don't need everyone knowing about this, you know what I mean? There, in the sand, is a hole. Frankie pulls out a piece of old cloth. On it is written, Tell no one. Bring us the key, or the two birds get it. Birds? Elena and Julio are not birds. Love birds, because they're in love. Or at least the kidnapper thinks they are. I believe they are using it against their families. If they do not get along, it would create trouble for the one who found this. For the one who knew... Frankie, how did you come upon this note? Uh, the other night at the races, uh, someone left it next to my snacks. I, uh, figured it was random. Hmm, I do not believe it was. I think the kidnapper wanted you to have it on purpose. So now, I ask you, what do you know about the key? And what do Elena and Julio have to do with it? Well, I can tell you a story. You got some time? Oh, all night. To be continued. <laughs>